Okay, so this is just a quick uh, video just to demonstrate um, the sort of alternative firmware that I've built uh, for the FG100. Um, as you can see, we've got uh, the unit sitting here. Um, I'm just powering it off one of these um, USB battery packs just to um, prevent any problems with uh, ground loops or anything like that. It could be present if you try to power this off USB. Um, and it's just connected by this. Uh, coax cable to my scope. So we'll just power this guy up. You can see we've got the um, alternate there. Um, obviously, a, a couple of little changes here are uh, uh, showing exactly you know which uh, um, digit that you're editing. Um, like the old one, you can switch the digits around. I've gone the other way around here. I would have thought that uh, one of those ones around the middle is probably more likely uh, a number you want to change, so let's look at first. Um, just like the basic firmware, you can switch between the various um, waveforms. Um, similarly, we can zoom up and down, change those, we start the waveform. Um, so, oh, there we go. Um, um, we can see the waveform coming up here. So we can see this. Um, we're getting a pretty stable frequency here. About 500 hertz. So if we just stop this guy, you can see the first big improvement there is we go back to the very start. Something that I found very frustrating with this unit. So if we switch to uh, sine wave, um, increase the frequency up, let's say, um, oh, touchy, to a thousand hertz, and start that up. Give it a nice. Um, as you can see, the frequency count is fairly close. We're just sitting on 999974.974. Cool. So that's basically um, my first release. Obviously, there's a few little touchy bugs in there um, with my uh, handling. Um, but again, um, it is a lot more usable. Um, all of the other controls obviously work as expected before. Um, if we switch to say triangle wave here um, and activate the um, output, we can adjust the um, amplitude. Um, yeah, it's just going outside of my trigger range there, but I can adjust the um, Offset also. Cool. Well, that's the uh, the unit. Um, as you can see, I have started playing around with a few extra things here. Um, obviously, a, a rotary encoder um, is is sort of the first start there. Cool. Cheers.